hello everyone welcome to my channel asp.net core and today i am going to show you how to define properly area in asp.net core so here we have a link with the asp area asp controller asp action but area is not uh, actually uh, working properly um, because and in the controller section also have a area specified but when we click on the uh, controller name like that bus uh, that is not working not found error occurs uh, so how to resolve and how to fix that type of error actually and how to uh, work with the area so here we have properly define your endpoints and the pattern also so here we have a endpoints that is map controller routes and uh, the pattern is firstly define the area uh, name like uh, admin area and the customer area you have <coughs> and the controller name is defined under the area if the controller exists okay so here we that is the pattern actually area equals to customer controller is a home but it's not working because uh, under the customer we have uh, uh, we have not actually uh, home exist you can check it okay so uh, if you want to uh, if you want to like uh, if you want to show uh, some extra fields at here like uh, admin area and we have a in admin area is not also contain the home controller actually admin area con contain the bus controller so it's not working with the admin also so now just last thing is to change the controller name that is the bus controller and the action is also exist in the bus controller that is index and id is optional so it's working properly so here we have so thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to asp.net core